New at 6, in an exclusive interview with Channel 2 Action News, Governor Brian Kemp talked about the bills he signed into law, including a controversial one that creates a commission to oversee Georgia's prosecutors. Channel 2's Richard Elliott is live at the state capitol. Richard, the governor says he's most proud of the state's budget. Yeah, $32 billion pay raises for teachers, law enforcement, and state employees. But as you said, perhaps the most controversial uh, law, new law involves that prosecutorial oversight commission. Critics claim the law targets Democratic prosecutors across the state, including the one in Fulton County. We fulfilled our priorities once again. We talked exclusively one-on-one -on -one with Governor Brian Kemp now that the post-session flurry of bill signings is over. The governor crisscrossed the state, signing everything from a bill requiring Georgia schools to conduct active shooter drills to one forcing local municipalities to enforce their own ordinances on the homeless. But he's most proud of the $32 billion budget, one he says the fully funds K-12 education. Did what we told people we were going to do on the campaign trail, so we did teacher pay raises, law enforcement pay raises again. And with the amended budget, we gave a billion dollars back to the taxpayers. He also talked about the bill that makes recruiting children into street gangs a felony punishable by up to 20 years in prison. Other than the bill banning outside money for local elections offices, perhaps the most controversial bill he signed is the one creating a prosecutorial oversight commission, a commission that oversees district attorneys and other prosecutors across Georgia. Many believe the bill was designed to target Fulton County DA Fonnie Willis for her investigation of former President Donald Trump and others. Kemp says that's not the case. Instead, he insists the commission will go after prosecutors it believes are not prosecuting certain crimes, either on purpose or through incompetence. People are just fed up. They are fed up of local prosecutors that are not doing their job. They're not uh, fulfilling their duties and their oaths under the law and prosecuting the crimes that are on our books. Prosecutors like Fonnie Willis, including Fonnie Willis, dispute that. Willis herself testified against the bill when it was still in committee. Uh, her office had no comment today on the bill signing. We are live at the state capitol. Richard Elliott, Channel 2 Action News.